Halo guys, kembali ke channel saya Tokasio. Pada konten kali ini saya akan mereview salah satu pemain hidden game yang mana di sini ada pemain dari Newcastle yang mana nanti kalian bisa lihat sendiri untuk tingginya gila, Cok. Ya, di sini ada pemain namanya itu De Bruyne. Aslinya itu LP namun di sini cocoknya itu eh kecepi sih karena dilihat dari posturnya gila, Cok. Nanti kalian bisa lihat sendiri ya. Tembus 2 meter anjir, maka dari itu saya diposisikan CP oke yang pertama untuk racikan gambar bola itu saya isi 4 terus gun saya isi 4 terus gambar eh, bentar bentar apa lagi untuk memaksimalkan kecepatannya gambar sepatu saya isi 9 biar tembus 80 terus gambar jam itu saya isi bentar 8 6 maksud saya terus gambar tameng itu sisanya saya isi 17 sehingga Gila sih agresinya tembus 99 ini kalau di in game. Oke. Selanjutnya kita akan reviewnya di online match divisi 1 ya dengan rating keseluruhannya 87 dan di formasi 89. Oke. Langsung saja kita akan reviewnya. Oke, namanya kita menemukan lawan divisi 1 ya. Hmm, baru masuk divisi 1 sih ini. Oke, intinya kita akan reviewnya yang ini ya The De Burn dengan rating 89, posisinya LP cuma saya taruh di CP karena Gila cok kalian bisa lihat sendiri tingginya 201 meter ini dia ya dengan back gaya main back saya bertahan terus untuk statistiknya ini dia sundulannya 81 gila kesadaran pertahannya 93 nekel 94 agresi 99 keterlibatan pertahannya 96 gila cok terus kecepatannya 81 kontak fisik 91 stamina 90 dan minusnya ini tidak ada pemblokir ya cuma ada sundulan pengamanan ketat super di udara sapuan akrobatik oke intinya kita akan reviewnya sejago apa di in game oke kita lihat squad lawan nampaknya pakai formasi sepahan SC juga sih oke langsung saja untuk review dari pemain jangkung ini simak video berikut ini excitement and it has built nicely in these idyllic conditions conditions which are certainly playing their part in creating a glorious ambience It's quite a struggle to get in here, points of access, hard to come by, and an awful lot of people gathering to get through the gates. But regardless of that, there's a great feel here and much excitement for the game ahead. And expectations are rising and decibel levels are rising. The noise is quite something. You can feel what football means to the people in this part of the world. We're underway here. Fires from distance. And no one is overly concerned about that. Yeah, he's disappointed with himself, but at least his boss is applauding the effort he made. Belly. And that interception was most necessary. Strong running down that left flank. And it's Mane. They've got to make this nice and quick. De Bruyne spread out to the left. He's making a real surge on the left. Oh, now here's an interesting matchup. Well, the defence proved infallible then. But that won't be the last they'll see of him. He's through here. Vinicius Junior. Ross deflected behind for a corner. Premio with their first corner. The first in the game for either side, actually. And the defence can get it clear. Chavez can counter properly here. Now it's Figo. He's gone away. Mbappe. The most accurate pass. Chavez who go ahead look there just wasn't much of a gap to begin with and to find it I think it was a fine drive and I don't think the keeper could have really planned for that I think he's a bit unlucky in that instance Chavez draw first blood here 
Yeah, this is also a chance to see what happens to their level of concentration from here. He's in, surely! Mbappe! And that's caused him to actually steer it goalwards. Grignard cuts it out. It's a decent chance to counter-attack. Played out to the left flank. Mbappe. Petri. The ball is loose and the chase is on. Disappointed with that. Casemiro. Nice sequence of passes this. Belly. Threads one in. One Bissaka gets it across to intercept that. This time. Passes just off target. And the half-time whistle goes. Steady, solid, and for now, where they want to be. Just one goal. Taking place. We're underway again. Chavez going well here and they're in a good position to kick on and add to their lead. They don't have to overcommit, but they can place more emphasis on stretching their advantage without necessarily neglecting things defensively. Oh, good read. That'll be a throw. Over to the other side. Vigo, James, here's Barrios, this is what good chemistry is all about, and that was very necessary, now it's Figo. James, James Croft, up to meet it! they've been looking for great header made it look easy well look it's it's often the timing of the jump that dictates what you can do the with any header and if you get it slightly wrong then you'll struggle but that was beautifully met it really was things starting to look very comfortable well at 1-0 this contest was still nicely poised but now that it's gone to two mindsets are affected a lot more winning belief one way and that losing f he's having a go he has hit that forcefully yeah it didn't come off but it Bellingham and that's been intercepted Coman yeah he's pulled him up for that challenge ball's gone out of play Decent progress down the left. He's left his man. Chavez have turned up with a, a human blockade. This is top defence. Figo. This might spell danger. De Bruyne crosses. Towering header. A reprieve, albeit perhaps momentary. James is looking to set free a runner and that's been leave it clear now it's Mbappe a real chance to break he's found a way through I'm not quite sure he needed to hold up play quite as much as he did then a couple of his teammates were very annoyed Mbappe a good fall kindly and he hit him left grandstand finish 
and he's only too grateful to capitalise on the keeper's misfortune. Well, they say all goalkeepers are crazy, and after that, maybe there's some truth in it. Premio give themselves a chance of a fairy tale finish. Well, the mindset has changed. Now they need to find all the courage they can get. Mbappe. Now it's Figo. De Bruyne. Decent strike. Chavez. Corner number two then. And the referee. Oke itu dia review dari De Bruyne. Pemain dari Newcastle yang hidden gem dengan tinggi 201 meter sih. Ini cuma minusnya tidak ada pemblokir dan juga agak berat sih karena dia pemain jangkung besar. Biasanya kalau pemain besar itu berat banget. Emang kalau diajak akselerasi atau sprint auto kalah sih. Kalau di sprint sama Mbappe auto kejar kacir intinya. Tapi, tapi ini pemain worth it kalau dibuat di CP terutama di sudut-sudutan kada obat J 201 ya. Oke kalian bisa lihat uh, pencari pemain ini di klub Newcastle terus posisinya LP dan kalian bisa rekrutnya dengan harga murmer murah meriah dengan GP ya. Cuma 32 GP. Oke cukup sekian reviewnya jangan lupa like, comment dan subscribe.